Welcome back for another episode of Win One Take One. I want to say this is episode number 20, so kind of a landmark there, getting to episode number 20. Uh, I've got more episodes of this than uh, the, the Outcasts out there, but I'm enjoying both of them at the moment. But in today's episode, we're up against Newcastle and Tottenham. Newcastle, we need we need three points from them. Uh, we're, we're slowly but surely, well, not slowly, but fastly, getting into a relegation battle. We're only four points ahead of uh, the team in uh, 18th position in the league. So this is our starting lineup. It's the same same lineup as against Chelsea. Spiegel, Creswell, Ogbonna, Reed, Martin, Song, Ture, Fabregas, Payet, Sacco, Moses. So we'll we'll see how that does, and uh, hopefully we can turn around our fortunes. Now we lost against Newcastle earlier this season, so we need to try and do better. They're playing four four two against us. Uh, I'm not going to go through all the players. You can see for yourself there. Um, yeah, so we've got to watch Wijnaldum and Sissoko, obviously, on the width. But apart from that, let's hope for a good match. Come on, we, this, like, I'm, I'm really nervous about this one. Like, the games against Man City and Chelsea in the last episode, I wasn't that nervous about because I, I'm not expected to win. Where this match, we need to win. Uh, Yaya Tura has picked up a fire strain after two minutes. But it says he can stay on. They've had three sh Oh, I'm on defensive. What an idiot. I'll go on counter. Here's Sizoko. Cuts inside. Elke Elkeng. Ekeng. When Yaldum hits the bar, one mat, Creswell will clear it. Yeah, I I that was my fault. I, w I was on defensive from uh, the last match against Chelsea. I'll go to counter. Yeah, I'm actually going to stand it, actually. We're not going to counter him. Screw that. But I was wondering why they had so many shots. and It was because we were on defensive. Like, idiots. Come on, let's see. 22 minutes in. Can anything happen? Martin heads it on. Moses can't get there. Hadara will get it. Wijnaldum. Ekeng. For Cisse. Skins our defender. Good save by Spiegel. The corner will follow. Comes in. Tura heads it out. Good defending. Second corner. Take two. Action. Cisse. Martin off the line, wow, CC got a good header to that one that time. Fabgas will just boot it clear and almost hits um, whoever Newcastle's manager is. Steve McLaren. <laughs> we get a corner. I couldn't remember the Newcastle manager's name there. Uh, Fabregas whips it in. Turo will pick it up. And he shoots! Oh, what a strike! That is what we get for getting a player like Turo. His first goal for us. That was brilliant. A goal from nowhere. Our first shot on target. Harsh on Newcastle, but we're 1-0 in front. I'll, I'll go to defensive. We'll start the second half defensive as well, I think. <laughs> We've had one shot on target and we're winning 1-0. That is what the quality of players like Yaya Toure brings to the team. Uh, I'll tell them I want to see more from them, really. Yeah, I know your kit will have even better. Not really a great reaction, but the team's doing well. Like None of them are complacent or... None of them reacted badly. Fabregas goes along for Song. Yeah, it's just a normal high to start off the second half. Ekeng needs to be closed down, so we'll do that. Oh, they've, they've actually taken him off straight away. He's Will Nando with a free kick. I can't say his name. Spiegel will save it. Win Nyaldum. Nailed it. Uh, <laughs> no, not. Uh, here we go. Come on. Who, who is that to, honestly? He's Williamson, Sizoko, Gufran. Cisse makes the run off the defender. Can't get the crossing though. And Paye will mop that up. Or will he? No, it goes to Cisse. Sizoko, good save by Spiegel. paye has got to clear that. He's got to clear that. Right, I'm going to make some subs. In fact, I can't because I need to wait, wait for these changes to apply. Fabregas is playing well. Payas really went off form lately. We'll bring on Bakambu. He, yeah, he can stay the inside four. We won't change our system. And uh, Creswell for Mulgrew, I think. I'll, do I actually put Mulgrew on defend as well? Yeah, I'll be, I will do. Just sit back a bit now. We don't need to attack. We just need to soak up their pressure. But we've had another shot on target in this. So we're doing we're doing great. Until I jinx it as a highlight straight away. 
Tiote to Sizoko. Cece, who's done well against us so far. Martin will clean that up. Spiegel. Sacco, good take. Plays it behind Moses, but he'll still get it. Martin goes long for Sacco. Williamson will tackle him. Wijnaldum, Teote, Sizoko. Gufran has got loads of room. Early cross in. Ogbonna heads it. Sizoko. Teote. One mat. Gufran. Whips it in. Favin. Oh, he managed to get it away. How are we holding on to a team like fucking Newcastle like this? That was a terrible pass. End the highlight, please. Highlight end. 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 Oh, fuck. It's going to be another attack. Gufran. Farvin. Oh, Bonner heads it out. And I think it was Reed. In fact, it comes back in. Stop. Just boot it anywhere. Fabrias, boot it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm so stressed. Right, um, I've got one more sub left, so I'll go and I'll make that change right now. Uh, let's have a look. Reed will come off. I'm going to bring on Collins because Tompkins was shit against Chelsea when he came on. He kept getting skinned. Like Costa was skinning him. Like I think it happened like three times I can remember. So we'll bring on Collins. There's a highlight. Ugh, it's bound to be a Newcastle attack, isn't it? Saka oh, Moses should pick that up. He does. He's tackled. How is that not a foul? Come on. Wijnaldum. Nailed that pronunciation now. <laughs> Infos one Dutch uh, comment saying that I murdered it. Callback. Gufran's got a lot of space again. Whipped it in early. Mulgrew. How have you given away a penalty? It went nowhere near you. Fucking hell. Mulgrew had it. Ogbonna was at least three or four yards away from me. He's got another second yellow cut. He's got a yellow, second yellow card. And he's off. Fuck this game, man. Two red centre-back like he did in that Champions League final. How can, my, how can you play there, but not there? What a fucking retard. How stupid are you? Probably because he's a striker. Look, wait, time for Carl's tactical experiments. I actually like that. <laughs> uh, Toure is going to be... It's going to be a limited defender. He's actually better as a ball-playing defender, so why not stop up? Yeah, fine. But they're, go they're going to equalise, and they're going to... They, they were all over us when they had 11 men. Oh, God, this is stressful. Honestly, thank God that I've got the manager is unsackable on, because otherwise this series would have ended, I swear. What I'll do now is... We've, we've, we've got to be deeper we've, we've got to go on contain as well I have won matches when I've been on contain actually so hopefully that can still happen we don't need to do that, we'll shoot on sight Pump, uh, no, I'll, I'll clear to flanks more than anything go route 1 now hopefully they missed this penalty he's a spoiler they won't <laughs> Here it is, Cesar, he's, he's played play well against us today. But can he equalise from the spot? Cesar against our retired goalkeeper, he scores. Ah, this game it is killing me. A draw won't be too bad, but it's, it's not matter because we're not going to draw, because he has called back 2-1. Fuck this game. <laughs> Earlier this season, I absolutely loved this serve. Like, I was playing it all the time. I, I was like weeks ahead in, like, well, a week and a half ahead in my recording. But now I'm struggling. Like, don't get me wrong, I, I am still enjoying the, the, like, the whole concept of it. We just need to turn our luck around. Where we just have a lot of bad luck lately. And... Honestly, Ogbonna gave away the penalty. He was nowhere near the ball. He didn't have to make that foul. And in the process, he got himself sent off and continued a penalty. Yeah, your, your mistake cost us, you fucking cunt. Alright, send the assistant. Enough of me swearing. 
Uh, what I am going to do, though... Obviously, I can't lose a player because I, I, I've already lost everyone. Ogbonna. For that, you, my friend, 60 grand a week, you're getting one pound a week. Fuck you. Find two weeks' wages. How was that unfair? Oh. Speak to Ogbonna. Fucking hell. There. He sees where I'm coming from. What an idiot. The way that he gave away a, pen a penalty and he says the fine's unfair. Like, honestly? Like, have you seen our run of form? <laughs> right, um, I'm going to head into the next match against Spurs, so I'll fast forward and I'll be right back in a few days. Spurs are second, so we're going to lose. It's, it's quite funny, if I, if I lose this match, the, the randomizer hasn't been involved in quite a few episodes, which is a bit concerning. But it's better than a losing place. Like, look at this. We've dropped down more, but we're still four points off the relegation places. Uh, I'm confident that we won't get relegated, but we're almost guaranteed to lose today against Spurs. You could go second if they win. They've got a game in hand on Man City. So, come on. Let's see. Uh, Opiang's being left out. Yes, because he doesn't, he doesn't play for us. Well, he plays for us, but I don't, I don't play him, I mean. Let's see. Uh, passionately. Go out there and impress me. Take a quick look at Spurs lineup. So Dyer, Alderweireld, Vertonghen, Rose, Bentaleb, Mason, Chadley, Prato, Townsend, and Harry Kane up front. So we'll go in. Please don't lose. Like we're not losing badly. We we just we've lost by one goal in like the last few matches. So we just need to turn that around. Get a bit of luck. Not get stupid red cards that cost us matches against Newcastle. <coughs> in the in the press conference afterwards, it said I guess I always send Zidane, who's my assistant manager, and it said um Zidane absolves Ogbonna of um responsibility or whatever it was for costing us the match. I was like, fuck you. It was his fault. How can you say it wasn't his fault? Anyway, he's the first highlight. I've talked for 20 minutes of the match just about Ogbonna <laughs> so far. Sako from Moses. Come on, just play a long ball. That's fine. Fabregas, Sako is in. Don't be offside. Come on, shoot. It's in 1 0. It isn't offside. It's 1 0. 24 minutes in. We grab a goal. We've done well so far. Three shots, three on target. Three half chances as well. That's impressive. Come on, let's keep that up. There's a highlight straight from the kickoff. Bentaleb, Prato, Kane, Townsend cuts inside. Bentaleb, Prato, Dyer, uh, Kane. It's 1 1. They've equalised straight away. Fucking hell! They, they, they just like to troll me. There's another highlight, 37th minute, Mason to Dyer, Chadley crosses in, almost went to Kane, Alderweireld will get there, Dyer again, crosses again, Oof, we make them, <sighs> definitely trolling me now, what the hell was that goal, Alex Hull made the mistake, they hit the post and it falls to Kane who has a tap in, this is ridiculous, honestly, I need to stop getting so angry about this this game and stop swearing so much in my episodes. Alderweireld with a free kick. What? How does that happen? The, I'm positive that ball was going wide. Let me just. I'm fucking. Re, I'm re rewinding this. He's me saying, "Don't get so angry." Take a look at that free kick. It's it's definitely going wide. Fuck off. Pause it. You idiot. That's gone wide. It's curling away. He's, that is fucking... Uh, stupidity at its finest in this match. He's me saying, like, we haven't, we haven't been playing too, too badly. Like, Sacco's got an 8.1, just saying. But uh, our defence is horrible. And I, I, I need to win a goalkeeper. Like, it's getting to the point where... If I play, like, I'm from a random t team now, if I play Aston Villa next, I will cash in 
my wild card, and I'll get Brad Guzan. That's that's how bad things are. Yeah, I knew they'd react badly to that as well, but I don't care. The match is over, so whatever. I can't believe that. Like Their goals were stupid. Fair enough, one of them was okay. You could probably get away with it. But the last two were defensive messes. Goes long for Kane. Reid will clear it out. Chadley will pick it up again. This is straight from the kickoff, by the way. Mason for Prato. Townsend, good save. Crosses it in. Nothing's happening. Goes back out to Townsend. Yeah, we can get that away now. Sacco with four people right on him. He did well, but he, he couldn't get the pass. I, I don't really blame him for that. He had no support. Mason with the free kick. Townsend will pick it up for Tongan. Back to Rose. Bentaleb. Mason. Whipped in towards Kane. Dio will pick it up. Crosses it in. Chadley hits the post. I, we haven't really had like a terrible performance this season. I know you guys can probably think of some, but I can't off the top of my head right now. He's another free kick, by the way. Um, but this is our first really bad performance of the season. Like we could lose this match 5-1. Quite, quite easily as well. It could be more. He's Chadley. Townsend at the back post. Hits the bat. How do you hit the bat from there, Townsend? No wonder you went to Newcastle. Spiegel will pick that up. Right. Time to make some changes. Time for a, a tactical masterclass. Yeah, Arturo. He, I, I know I'm playing him as a defensive midfielder. Because I, I have to. Um, but he's been terrible for us so far. I'm actually... I'm going to... I'm. I'm gonna have to like change my formation, aren't I? Like looking forward into like the future. Like, but how how do I change it? Maybe if I do like a a diamond, like I know that will leave Moses like nowhere to be seen. Really, I'm gonna try Bakambu up front. Why not? Because Cameron in a sub is in the last three matches. Complete forward. Are you having a laugh? I bet he is shit as a comp complete forward. We'll, we'll try it. We'll try it. Uh, we'll make the two subs now. Uh, tactical changes. I'm not really going to do too much because like we're still under pressure a lot. Uh, I might go. Should I, I try counter? We're now being over in the midfield. That always happens whenever whenever you have four plays in midfield. It's it. It always says you're being over in the midfield. They make a couple of subs. Thank God they've took Townsend on. He's honestly he's looked like Messi against us. Need to close down Kane. Uh, I've got a final sub. Why? Why did I move Song across? Yeah, but like, look, look, looking into the future, I might have Song here, Fabregas, Yaya, Paye, then Sako and someone else up front. It might not work because I, I don't know. I I just think that I need to have two defensive midfielders in this formation. But none of them can be Fabregas or Toure. <laughs> it, it's it's horrible, honestly. Uh, we'll bring on Obiang because why not? And um, look at the instructions. We, pro we probably can't do anything though. Go slightly higher. Shoot on sight. Uh, pump ball into the box. Route one. Get stuck in. And I've just pressed undo. Did I? No, I didn't. Oh, I thought I did. <laughs> I would have been raging. But yeah, we'll save those changes. Come on. Why am I still on counter? We'll go overload. Why not? He'd make an interesting end to the match if he got two, two late goals. Although we're still under heavy pressure according to the commentary at the bottom there. Here's a highlight. Noble. Creswell. Goes long for Bakambu. Yes! He is a complete forward. I knew it, Bakambu. I've got... <laughs> I, I honestly punched my wall there celebrating. Ah, my knuckle hurts. Come on, five minutes to go. One more goal. It's, it's not going to happen. 
uh, happening. It's not going to happen. Honestly, the trolling by FM, it's full time. The trolling in this match was, has been top notch. Fair play, FM. You've, you've got me. I'm, I'm mad. But, you know, I'm just, I can't bother. My assistant can deal with it. But yeah, I'm, I'm definitely going to look into change my, my formation. Uh, I think the narrow diamond will work. It, it might say that we're overrunning midfield quite a lot. So I'll have to try and try and figure out a way to uh, to solve that. But in, in theory, have like, I'll quickly do it because I'm, I'm not doing a randomizer because obviously I can't. I've already lost too many players. So I've got a bit of time. So we'll do we'll do this. Tourist Cup tie for Man City, so I can't do it in the next match. We'll do that. <laughs> how about if I just just leave Moses there? How, how do you think that would work? We'd, we'd get we'd get murdered down that side. That's what would happen. Um, can I put him as two defensive midfielders? How about this? Obviously, obviously Moses won't be there. Uh, but we we have got a lot of central midfielders, so it might might be something we can do for the next match against Man City. I might try this. Depends on the fitness. I'll have to check on the, the day of the match. I might try something like this. I'm, I'm not sure who I'm going to put it right back, actually, because um, Tompkins picked up an injury. Ogbonna, maybe. But anyway, I'll quickly rack, uh, wrap up this episode. I can't talk at all. So this is the formation you're going to see me try in the next match. We're, we're away to Man City. We've, we're, we're losing 1-0 on aggregate against them. And who else are we facing? Come on. Uh, Arsenal. Great. <laughs> Man, uh, Man City and Arsenal in the next episode. So thank you guys for watching. We're going to test out this formation. Uh, the Dick formation? <laughs> Why not? Uh, yeah, so thanks for watching. Unfortunately, it's another two defeats. It's just the way it happens. We've got... I, we our goalkeeper is terrible. Our defense is terrible. We've got injuries as well to deal with. But thank you guys for watching. Uh, after the next episode, we've we've got, we've got four winnable matches. Yeah, winnable matches. Uh, let's have a look. So we've got Man City and Arsenal. Then the two teams from Birmingham. Well, West Bromwich and but yeah. Um, uh, West Brom and Aston Villa. Then we we actually can do the Saint Etienne as, a, as like one episode, which I'm quite happy about. Then, then we have Liverpool and Everton, Chelsea, Watford. And then we've actually got a decent run towards the end of the season, although it's it's going to come down to the Man City match at the end of the season for whether we get relegated or not. I can see it now, calling it right now. Yeah, but that's that's a long way in the future. So thank you guys for watching so much. And um, like I said. At the start of the season, we were doing well. Now we've won on a bad turn. Like you can, this is what happens when you start losing players in this series. So things will pick up. Um, I've I've done this series before on an all uh, an old channel. It wasn't quite as bad as this, but we do like it does come in like ups and downs until you get like a, a good a good team. Basically, you have to get a bit lucky in the randomizer. But uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.